welcome to my channel, Nurse Rachel and Crafts. Today I have a belated sneak peek or first look for you from Diamond Art Club. Diamond Art Club, thank you as always for sending such a beauty over for me to share. I am so grateful. Thank you. The one I have, you guys, is this beauty from Micah Jelena. It's called Lucy. And it's another one of her panel images. And I am so excited to see this one. It is a square diamond painting and look at the size, 55.8 by 121.8 centimeters or 22 by 48 inches. Wow. So this beauty is available right now on Diamond Art Club's website. Your painting will come inside of this dust bag that says Diamond Art Club, do what makes you sparkle. You will get this smaller sticker. You can put this on the outside of your box for storage. You can put it in a log book, make a cup reminder out of it, put it on your crafting table. No wrong answer. You will also get a toolkit. The contents of your toolkit may vary from mine. Because your painting is square, you will get this pair of beautifully branded tweezers here. And they are quite sharp. Items that will be the same in each kit will be this tray with a matching stopper, a plastic bag of baggies, a heart-shaped container with two pieces of heart-shaped wax on the inside. The wax comes with two pieces of plastic on the top of it, so just peel that back and then you are good to use the wax. You will also receive two thin multi-placers, a four and a seven placer. Items that may vary slightly will be the color of your applicator pen and grippy. You will receive washi tape and your design may vary as well. You do get a good amount. You will also receive a cover minder and the design of your cover minder may vary. This is so pretty and they do come with double magnets and you use these to hold the plastic bag on your canvas. Rolled inside your canvas will be this pamphlet. On the cover is a thank you note from the founder. Here is everything that's included in your kit. Here are tips and tricks. Down here is a discount code. Now here are all the places where you can find discount codes. With Dumb Art Club, you never have to pay full price for a kit, not even with your first purchase. You can use my code NURSERACHEL20 to save you 20% off your first purchase. There will be more information about my code in the description box. This page has a barcode that will take you to a video that shows you step-by-step -step how to diamond paint. Down here is another barcode and that takes you to the Diamond Art Club VIP Facebook group. This page here will have step-by-step -step instructions on how to diamond paint. And then on the back will be two more barcodes, one for iPhone, the other Android, and they take you to the Diamond Art Club app. Now, if you've never purchased through the app, you are able to save 20% off that first purchase. And this applies to new and old customers. Also rolled inside your canvas will be this larger sticker sheet. This entire page is a sticker. Look at that beautiful art. It will have a start end date, all the specs there. And then on this side will be all of your colors and symbols. So there are 57 colors in this one. And let's see, number 57 has the letter Z in front of it. And that stands for a fairy dust diamond. And those diamonds have a glitter coating on top that are just beautiful. 56 is a color in the 6,000s. Diamond Art Club has started expanding the color code a bit. So this is another one of their colors that they've made and I am beyond excited to see what that looks like. It looks like it would be like a gray. And then up here at the top, I am seeing three ABs. With Diamond Art Club, any number under 150 is an Aurora Borealis diamond. And those are diamonds that have an iridescent coating on them that make them sparkle more. These stickers here, they are pre-cut, so kitting up is going to be super easy. And then you do get extra stickers here. Your diamonds do come labeled, so if you prefer to store them apart from your canvas, you will know what diamonds go to what canvas. Okay. <laughs> 
Oh, you know what, you guys? You guys, this plastic here is perforated. Oh my goodness. So if you've not heard yet, Diamond Art Club, they have changed the plastic on their canvases to start having perforated sections on them. And you guys, oh my goodness. Let me see if I can pick it up. Hmm. Oh, right there. I think you can see it here. And then I know I should be showing the cameras right now. <laughs> right there, you can see the line. Oh, I want to see how big is one section. Let's see. Oh, it's not too big. Okay. <laughs> sorry. Sorry about that. I That just, that really made me excited. I could feel it when I was unrolling it. Okay. Let me focus, right? Okay. So, she's long. So, here's the bottom part. Oh, my. I love it. Yeah, she's a long one. <gasps> Look at her. Oh, she is beautiful. Let's see. Look at her. Oh, my goodness. Wow. Oh, she's long. <laughs> so as you can tell, Lucy here is steampunk. And I know so many of us, number one, not only love Micah's art and her beautiful girls, her fairies, but we also love steampunk. So I love that we get both in this one here. I think this art is absolutely beautiful. Again, I just love Micah's girls and I always say that I like that most of them don't have or don't seem to have a race to them. The skin is just white or like this one here, her skin is a bit gray. And I just love that. She's beautiful. Now, in terms of confetti versus color blocking, confetti is where in a small section of the painting, it is multiple colors. Color blocking is the opposite. In that same section, it's predominantly one color. This image here has more color blocking than confetti, but it does have both. The confetti will be found mainly in her hair, in the feather attached to her pin that she's using. Everywhere else will either be color blocking or line blocking. So I love that. So even though the size is really big, if you are a multi-placer, you're going to fly through most of this painting very, very quickly. So while you continue to gaze at this beauty, I want to talk about Diamond Art Club and the canvas for a moment. So Diamond Art Club, they are a licensed diamond painting company, which means they pay all of their artists, which we love. They use pour glue and all paintings are hand charted. Their canvases are made out of tarpaulin, which is a material that allows for them to self flatten on their own in just a few moments. That material also allows for the canvas to maintain its color saturation, so you do not have to worry about your colors fading over time. On the back, a velvet coating is applied, which makes the canvas feel so soft and plush. And on the top, it is infused with micro specks of glitter all throughout, which I have found really enhances my enjoyment while I'm diamond painting. The edges here they have a type of surging along with scalloping that helps prevent any fraying. At the top of your painting, it will say Diamond Art Club with their motto, Do It Makes You Sparkle. On both sides, you will get a schematic or legend. You'll get one here in the upper left and then another in the lower right. The bottom left will have a thumbnail, the name of the painting, the size, and the artist. In the middle will be 
another discount code along with their social media on the bottom right is information about their lifetime warranty now let's take a look at the drill field and look for symbol clarity looks very very clear here now if you were to come across blurry symbols or find that your canvas is very damaged it is under a lifetime warranty which means that you can either get a new canvas or a refund your diamonds are under the warranty as well so if you run out of a color or have an accident where you spill them diamond art club will replace them for you yeah this is perfectly clear Okay, let's look at the diamonds. Diamond Art Club uses high quality resin for their drills. They also produce their own diamonds. Now their square drills were already upgraded to all have 13 facets instead of the mix of nine and 13 that you get from other places. Well, they've upgraded their square drills again to all have 20 facets. So you are going to get maximum sparkle shimmer and shine these drills are uniform in size with virtually no trash now it is still a transition period so some of your diamonds may have the 13 facets and some may have 20 but both are absolutely beautiful you will also notice under the dmc number here there are dash marks and that just helps you to know what color you're looking at now i will call some numbers but not all now starting off if you know micah you know that you're going to get a lot of 310 so we are going to get 10 bags of 310 here and i love that here is our first ab 141 the beautiful white color and i love this color ab one of my favorites it is so beautiful and you can really see the aurora borealis on it it is beautiful you will get two bags of 317 and then two bags of 3808 You'll get three bags of 160, four bags of 318. Here's our second AB 105. And you guys, we get three bags. <laughs> three bags of this beautiful, like taupey, caramely brown color. It is so pretty. And three bags. Wow. And then you'll get three bags of 413. That's a beautiful blue. 3766. So pretty. You'll get two bags of 898. And then I love this color 911. Oh, that's pretty. You'll get two bags of 632. Forgive the plane flying overhead. <laughs> And then here's that 6,000 color, 6020, like a soft gray, and it looks like just a little bit of purple in it. So, so, so pretty. And then this dark gray. You'll get two bags of 415. And two bags of 839. This lone bag of 437. Here's that fairy dust diamond Z3849. And we get two bags. So, so, so pretty. It's a teal color. Beautiful. More beautiful browns. Beautiful blue. And I'm loving this softer color palette here. These muted kind of earthy tones. I love it. Five oh one, that's pretty. Here's our third and last AB-122, and it's just a little bit, just a really small amount there. Beautiful green, so pretty. And then just smaller amounts 
of the colors here. So beautiful. Ooh, 955. Wow. Okay, let's see where those special drills go. Okay, the first AB is 105 and it's labeled with the number one. And it's this color here, this color brown there. So all of this down here, all up here. So I'm totally understanding why we had three backs. So yes, all the brown areas. I won't be able to find all, but I'll try. And more brown through here, all up through here, all around, and again in here. So going all the way around, and then around in there. And let's see, she has, yes, there's some here. And there and on the parachutes in the background and let's see if it's up here at the top it is so all throughout here so <laughs> this whole image is pretty much covered in that brown AB and I love that the second AB is that green one 122 that's labeled with the number two Ooh, okay, and that's the one where we did not have a lot at all. It was just a little bit, and it's this color. So, that color on her glasses. Okay, and let's see if I see it down here at the bottom, and I do not. The third AB is the white one, 141. It's labeled with a little dot, and it's all the areas that you see kind of a stark white color. So, highlighting here. And on the buckles on her boots here and there, all the speckles on her feather, this white area there. So yes, lots of just highlights it's there on her necklace, just speckled, speckled throughout her hair, her face, her glasses, all throughout here, all the white there. On the hat, her hair, the feathers up here, quite a bit. <laughs> and then the fairy dust diamond, Z3849. That's labeled with what looks like a little wand. Oh, you guys. I think we had two bags of that. And it's this color. Wow. Okay, so all of this is fairy dust. Oh, that's going to be so pretty. So all back here. And then she has some in her eyes. Oh, my goodness. So, yes, all the blue back there in the sky. And then I'm seeing it also right here. Wow. You guys, I really love this perforated plastic. I'm so curious, y'all. I'm going to pull it, see how hard it is. Oh, okay. So it peels apart pretty easy. Wow. But I can tell that if I wanted to leave it whole, I could do that too. So let me pull from this side and just leave it whole. See? It, it'll stay if you want it to stay whole. But if you want to rip it into the sections that Dem Art Club made for you, you can do that too. How cool is that? How awesome. I love that. So again, you guys, this beauty is available right now on Diamond Art Club's website. Thank you again, Diamond Art Club, for sending this beauty over. And thank you guys so much for watching. I appreciate you guys. Thank you. Thank you for your support. And until next time, bye.